Okay. <laughs> Hello. I'm going to start in two minutes. Um, I'm just going to wait and uh, see who joins. I am really hoping this is working. Oh, oh, I see Jamie is watching. Hello. <laughs> okay, we're going to start in two minutes. We're going to start in two minutes. <laughs> um, so whilst we're waiting, I would really like to just check the, uh, the latency again. Uh, so, uh, when I count to three, I'm going to ask you to just type down in the comment box, um, the word rain, the word rain. So, three, two, one, if you can type the word rain so I can see just how long it takes before I get to see what you've written. So, uh, three, two, one. Type in the word rain. Okay, fantastic. <laughs> well done. Thank you so much. Thank you, Jamie. Thank you, Andy. Okay, so that was probably about about 15 seconds, I think. Uh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> you can stop typing rain now. Okay, I think we're ready. Um, I am just gonna say um, we we don't have Hertie today to do the music. Um, he is working on something different um sadly our internet is broken um so thank you to katie mcgarry uh for helping me so that i could still do this <laughs> can you do rain <laughs> um so yeah i'm really sorry that we don't have any music today uh but that's okay because because we've got loads and loads of things that we're gonna do so, I think, I think we're about ready. Hello, Jackie. Hello, Mum. <laughs> okay, I think I'm ready to start telling my story. And the story today is called Anansi the Spider. So, I'm going to sign his name as A Spider. Um, he goes to dinner with Turtle. Um, maybe those could be our signs for the day. We could do a Nancy and Turtle. Turtle. So that's two hands. Turtle. Okay. So, <laughs> a Nancy mm -hmm. the spider goes to dinner with Turtle. Um, so this story, it starts in a Nancy's house starts in a nancy's house and a nancy oh he loves oh he loves eating and he doesn't like to share his food what kind of food do you think a nancy might like to eat what kind of food do you think he likes to eat hmm I think Nancy likes eating apples. He loves eating apples. What do you think? You can type in the comment box below. What does Nancy like to eat? Hmm. He likes to eat super worms, super worms, chicken from her tea, flies from Betty and Daniel, flies. Yeah, you're probably right. Pizza and flies from Zoe. Maybe he likes fly pizza. Oh, spider food. He loves spider food, definitely. Lots and lots of oh, delicious things for spiders to eat. He also liked food like you like. So what kind of food do you like? Oh, birds. Yeah, it could be birds. Oh, and you, she says flies as well. So... We say flies, we do love our flies because we are a spider. Hmm. 
lots and lots of things. Oh, chili fry flies, I like that. Chili flies, like hot flies. People, caterpillars, cereal. Yeah, do you know what? I love cereal. Ooh, oh, mosquitoes. Yeah, mosquitoes. I like it. Chili, of course. Peter's here and he says, Chili, I need to learn the sign for chili because I feel like it's going to be something I see a lot. Or oh, cheesy pasta. Pasta. Mmm, on Wednesday. Cheesy pasta Wednesdays. Yes, and Nancy loved all of this fantastic food. And um, do you want to meet a Nancy? I forgot. I have a Nancy here. Oh, chicken nuggets, Daniel. I think you're right. He loves. Do you like chicken nuggets, Nancy? Oh, and Nancy loves chicken nuggets. Mm -mm -mm. Um, so, one day, and Nancy had made all these delicious things to eat. He'd made himself his chicken nuggets. He'd made himself his fly pizza. He'd made himself his cheesy pasta. And he ate lots and lots of it. But there is a rule. There is a rule. the animal kingdom. If somebody comes to your house, then you have to share your food. You have to share your food. But Anansi, he doesn't like sharing. Oh, no, no, no. But one day, turtle came to his house. Turtle came to visit Anansi. Oh, he's very, very slow. Oh. Now, when Turtle arrived at Anansi's house, he just made his dinner. And Nancy, he looked down, oh no, oh, turtle, hello, I, I'm really happy you're here. <sighs> Thank you, said turtle, I'm excited to be here. <gasps> and look, you've made some dinner. That looks really nice, Anansi. And Turtle sat down to eat. Now, Anansi, who wasn't very happy, he really wanted to keep all of his food to himself. So, he had to think of a plan to get Turtle out of there. Aha! Uh -huh. He looked down at Turtle's feet. And where Turtle had been walking on the ground, his hands were all mucky. Ah! Oh. So Anansi said, Turtle, now, 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 you know that you can't eat before you've washed your hands. You must, must, must wash your hands quick before the food gets cold. Go. Ah, yes, you're right, said Turtle. I'll go and I'll wash my hands. And so off Turtle went to go and wash his hands. I love Anansi too, he's one of my favourite stories. And off he went. <sighs> so he went to wash his hands. Now, I have uh, something that Estelle actually taught me. Um, so we are going to wash our hands. So if, if 
you at home have got uh, some water and some bubbles, then this is the time to wash your hands. Are you ready? <gasps> Oh my goodness, those are my bubbles ready to wash my hands. Oh, um, hmm. I'm not going to sing happy birthday though. <laughs> we're going to wash our hands, so we're going to go like this, and then here, and here. We're going to wash our thumbs. Don't forget your wrists and all of your fingers. It should take 20 seconds. Mm. 20 seconds to wash our hands. Well, Turtle is really slow and it took him a really long time to wash his hands. And whilst Turtle was washing his hands, Anansi was really quick and he ate as much food as he could. What did he eat that was on the plates in front? What did he eat? What do you think? I think he started with the fly pizza. And he ate it really, really quickly. What else did he eat? I wonder what you are thinking. What did he eat? Mmm. Could he be eating? Maybe he started eating those chicken nuggets. <gasps> fries, of course, fries. He ate those fries. <gasps> oh, he thought those chips were delicious. <gasps> donuts, donuts from Betty. Oh, do you know what? Donuts are delicious. He had his dessert <laughs> and the salad bowl and chips. <gasps> macaroni fries I love that that's so good <laughs> macaroni flies I love it oh and curry curry oh delicious and biscuits and pasta um, dum, 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 dum. and he ate he ate loads and loads of the food including those chocolate hot dogs <gasps> oh yeah and those strawberry those strawberry flies Ooh. And when Turtle got back to the table and he looked, there's no, oh, there's only a few things here. Where did all the food go? And Nancy said, Turtle, you're too slow, but there's still a little bit of food here for us to share. You can have some of my chocolate hobnobs. Ah, thank you, said Turtle, and he sat down to eat. Do you think Anansi let him eat? No, you're right. He didn't. He said, ah, 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 turtle. I see your hands are still dirty. They're so dirty because you walked all the way back to the table on the floor. And now they're dirty again. You must wash your hands before you eat. You must go. Oh, yes, you're right. My hands are dirty again because I was walking really slow on the floor. I'll go and I'll wash them. So, off he went to wash his hands. Oh, I'm sorry, Turtle. It's no fun, is it? Look, 
he's not got a very happy face. He's got a crying tear now. He's not very happy. Well, and Nancy decided to eat more of the food. This time, he ate all the sweet things. Let's go for some sweet things. What sweet things did he eat? Mm. Mm. Do you know what? I really like apples. I think he ate an apple. Mm. <gasps> really nice. What else do you think that he ate? Can you type it below? <gasps> Fruit pastels, yeah, yeah, he ate fruit pastels. He ate them right up. What else did he eat? What did he eat? I wonder. Oh, I hope you've got some ideas because I was thinking maybe, maybe he ate um, ooh, some chocolate. Oh, yes, I like it, sweeties and Chocolate cake, strawberry cake, even strawberry cake. Um, dum, 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 dum. Oh, a galaxy bar though, that's chocolate, isn't it? <laughs> they ate loads and loads of chocolate. Oh, jelly and ice cream. Mm, donuts from Andy. Oh, and Nancy, you're spilling it everywhere. Oh, my goodness. Oh, was it nice, Nancy? It was tasty. Mmm. Well, and Nancy ate it all up until there was nothing left. That's right, Estelle. All the cake was gone. <gasps> yeah, all the sweet cake and the jelly cake, Andy. It was all gone. And when Turtle came back, oh, and walked mm -hmm. really slowly back, were meringue pie. Woof, oh. Were meringue pie. I like that. He looked down at the table and all of the food was gone. Oh. And Nancy. Where's all the food gone? Ah, uh, well, turtle, said Nancy. You were too slow washing your hands. And now I've eaten all of it. It's all gone because I didn't want it to get cold. Hmm. I'm sorry, Turtle. I guess you'll have to come back on a different day. <sighs> Turtle. Do you think he was happy or sad? I think he was probably sad. What do you think? Mm. <sighs> okay, said Turtle. I'll go and I'll come back on a different day. And so Turtle walked really slowly back to his house. Yeah, he was sad. He was sad, Jamie. But Turtle decided that he would think of a plan. He'd think of a plan because he realised that a Nancy had tricked him. A Nancy had eaten all the food before he could get to the table. And Nancy had lied about having to wash his hands twice. Mm. He is hurt. So he came up with a plan. And that plan was to ask Nancy to come to dinner. So Turtle got to cooking all of the best foods. Now mm -hmm. turtles they really like they really like vegetables. Vegetables. They really like vegetables. 
So, what sort of things what do you think that he made? Some vegetables. Hmm. What do you think he made? I think he made, ah, well, I really like aubergine. So, made an aubergine. What else do you think he might make? Oh, I like a carrot cake. He cooked that up. He made carrot cake. So we put that in. Do you know what? I actually have some carrots that we can put in that cake. Look at that. Whoa. So we put those carrots in there. What else did he like to eat? What? Oh, veggie pizza. Absolutely. We'll put all of that vegetable in there on a pizza. Oh, carrot soup. Oh, I just missed what Evie said. I think it was something to do with potato. Potato and pizza. Tomato soup. Oh, let's put those tomatoes in there. Carrots and potatoes. Oh, cheese stuffed peppers. I don't know the sign for peppers. Uh, Peppers, mmm, with cheese. Nice, let's put those in there, Jamie. And do you know what? I, oh, chili, chili. Maybe not the spiders yet, but chili, chili. Oh, we'll put that in there. And oh, vegetable soup, let's put that broccoli in there. Oh, and he cooked it all up. He cooked it all up in a nice pot. Now, turtle live? Hmm. Well, turtle lives somewhere very different to Anansi. Where do you think turtle lives? Hmm. I can give you a clue. He doesn't live in a normal house. Hmm. He doesn't live on land. Hmm. Oh, that's right, Andy. You're right. He lives under water. That's right. That's right. Absolutely. In a nice rocky pool. He lives in a nice rocky pool. Sometimes they are on the land, aren't they, Daniel? You're right, they do, because they sometimes they walk onto the land and that's where they lay their eggs and that's when they go to visit other people's houses. But he does live, yes, that's right, Evie, by a lake under the water. And so, when Turtle made all of this delicious food, he asked Anansi if he would come to his house to have some dinner. I guess he does live in himself, Peter, you're right. <laughs> and so, Anansi, he was really excited because he knew that Turtle loved cooking. Turtle cooked some delicious, lovely food. <gasps> And now, Anansi was going to get a free dinner. Oh! Well, Anansi went to Turtle's house really nice and quickly. Oh! <gasps> but when he got there, Turtle said, oh, Come on! on in. There he is in his underwater home. And he called out, and Nancy, look at all this lovely food. Come on down. Come and eat with me. <gasps> oh, it looked really nice. There were cheese stuffed peppers and chilli and flies with macaroni. Oh my goodness. And what else did he make? He made carrot cake. Oh no. And he made loads of soups out of loads of different things. 
pants. Oh my goodness. It looked so good. But what happened when a spider jumps to the water? Well, spiders can't go under the water. They float on the top. They float on the top. So and Nancy, when he jumped, oh, oh, oh no, I can't get under the water. That's right, spiders can't swim, but I can't get under. And he would float on the surface, looking down at Turkle, who had started to eat. That's not fair. I want to come down under the water. <sighs> I need to think of something to help me get under the water. I am too light. So every time I jump, I make a big splash. <gasps> oh. And then I just float on top. Oh, we won't kill a Nancy, don't worry, Martin. So, he splashed on the water. He splashed that water. Oh, turtle, I need to get down. Wait one minute for me. Turtle called up. Okay, but... I don't want all of our food to get cold. Quick, quick, Nancy. Mmm. So Nancy was thinking of something to come up with so that he could get under the water. What could he use? <gasps> Aha. I need to be heavy. So I will put things in my pockets that are heavy. What things can they put that are heavy in his pocket? What things can he put in his pocket that are heavy to help him go under the water? Hmm. What do you think? I think, hmm, maybe some sticks. Maybe some sticks. Mm -hmm. Oh, or blow a big bubble and get inside the bubble. Oh, oh, pebbles. A rock. Daniel and Betty. Daniel and Betty say a rock and logs. Ah, oh, and tools as well. Ah, oh, I think that's good. Rocks. Wow. I think eight diving fins, maybe. Well, we definitely got some of those rocks. Oh, that went in his pocket. And some sand. I think you're right. Shall we put some sand in there? So we got some sand. Now, this is that horrible kinetic sand. I didn't realise when I bought it, so it's a bit squishy. But I put some sand in there. He put some heavy metal. Oh, <laughs> is that like heavy metal like music or actual heavy metal? <laughs> he put some heavy metal. He put all of these things that were heavy into his pocket. He put those rocks. He put those sand. He put those tools. He put those logs. All of those things that were heavy, he put in his pocket. Mm. And when he put them in his pocket, oh, bloop, of course, he sank all the way down to the bottom under the water. And he saw Turtle, who had already started eating all of that lovely food. Oh, Turtle, you started without me. Oh, well, said Turtle. You were so slow finding things to get under the water. I had to start because I didn't want all of our food to get cold. But you can, you can 
have some food now. <gasps> and Nancy was really excited. Uh, and he went to grab some soup when Turtle said, Ah, 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 wait a minute, Nancy. You have your coat on. You can't have your coat on when you're eating dinner. That's so rude. Now, now, turtle, please, said Nancy. If I take off my coat, I'll float all the way to the top of the water. I have to have my coat on. Mm. Mm -mm. Mm, said Turtle. I don't think so. You see, it's rude. And we know that rules are rules. You must take your coat off before you eat your dinner. <sighs> okay. And Nancy took one sleeve off, just one. And he went to grab some of the carrot cake. Uh, Nancy, said Turtle, I see you still have one arm of your coat on. You can't have your coat on at dinner. You must, must, must take it off before you eat. <sighs> Woof! <gasps> and a Nancy, as he took off his coat, he bounced whoop, oh, all the way back to the top of the water. Oh no! He splashed and he splashed and he stood on the surface of the water looking down at Turtle. And Turtle was eating all of the lovely food all to himself and looking up. And Nancy! What happened? And he ate it. All of it. Every last one. Right. Now, how do you think Nancy felt watching Turtle eat all of that food on top of the water? As he looked down, you're right, he did feel a little bit sad. He felt a little bit angry. He felt a little bit foolish because he realised, ah, I did the same thing to Turtle. He did feel sad, but I did the same thing to Turtle. Maybe I should say something, something. To turtle. Yeah, he was jealous. He was sad. Like, like, same as turtle. Maybe I should say something to turtle. What? Do you know what to say? No? What should I say? Hmm. What do you think you should say? Hmm. I wonder, should he say, Ha! I didn't want your food anyway! Ha ha ha! Ah, I think, I think Emily has the right idea. Ah, and so does Evie. Oh, he could say, Chilly, I've been a meanie. And I'm sorry. I think you're right, Dahlia. I think. We should say sorry. Oh, so 
Anansi stood at the water and said, Turtle! Turtle! I'm sorry. I shouldn't have eaten all the food to myself. I should have shared it. I'm sorry. And then he asked Turtle one last thing. Turtle, please, come to my house. We can have all of the food we can think of. What things should we eat together? And they invite all of their friends too. So what sort of things could they eat together? And let's have a happy ending. <laughs> Spiders do apologise! And Nancy did. And Nancy said he was sorry. <laughs> so what things should we eat for our last dinner together uh, before I go? <laughs> what should they have? I, I really like I really like, uh, at the moment, I really like chocolate. I, I don't know about you, I love chocolate. <gasps> Ice cream sundaes! Oh, lovely! I think that's right. Slushies! I didn't even think of that! Slushies! Potato chips and pizza! That's yellow! Ooh, from Evie! <gasps> toad in the hole! Toad in the hole! And onion gravy! Taco! Broccoli! I love it! A bit of broccoli! <laughs> Definitely! I love that! <gasps> Fish! Fish and chips! I think that's right! Chicken and rice! I don't know the sign for rice, but chicken and rice is a staple! Chocolate cake! Absolutely! We love our chocolate cake! Oh my goodness! They cooked all of this food together! Oh, rainbow! Rainbow lollipops. I love that. That's really nice, Dahlia. Hand sanitizer. I think that's probably how they washed their hands first with hand sanitizer. And then they sat down together. And they had their meal of chocolate bars and chocolate cake. They ate their broccoli and they ate their pizza. They had their fish and chips and their Nando's. They ate together and they were happy. And Anansi learned that you shouldn't be selfish. You should share because when you share with your friends, what happens? Hmm. You have a really nice time and you learn new things that maybe your friends know and you get to share new memories together. And so they ate together and were very happy. And that is my story of Anansi and Turtle go to dinner. I really hope that you liked it. <laughs> um, I had loads of fun telling it and thank you for all of your answers as well. Uh, next time I will try my best for it to be something that is a little bit different. So maybe something without food this time because it makes me hungry. I feel really hungry. <laughs> So, thank you so much. Oh, I'm glad you liked it, Emily. Thank you for tuning in. It was really nice to see you all. If you are, um, if you are really enjoying all of the stories and all the different things that uh, Creative Distance Festival are bringing to you, um, and you'd like to, to to donate just a little bit of money, um, that would be really nice. Uh, the donate button is uh, if you donate to uh, paypal.me forward slash creative distance fest um, that's where you can donate and all of the money um, it's it's shared out uh, between all of the um, all of the artists 
and um, all of the creators mm. of Creative Distance Festival. So thank you so much. I'm really glad you enjoyed it because they got to play a trick on them. Oh, I'm really, I'm really happy that you liked telling and me telling and signing the story. Oh, thank you so much, Betty and Daniel. I I love telling you the stories and sharing my stories. Um, so yeah, I hope you have a really lovely week. And hopefully, I'll see you next Monday at the same time. Um, so next Monday at the same time, I'm really hoping that I can come back and uh, tell you a new story as well. Uh, so, <laughs> oh, I'm glad to see everyone enjoyed it. Thank you so much. <laughs> okay, I'm going to stop the feed now. Thank you so much, and I will see you soon. Bye.